Hi there, my name is Star Uzuki, and today we're going to be watching a Kitchen Nightmares episode, so I hope you enjoy, and please subscribe. Alright, I don't know what the heck I just stumbled upon. Look, what? This is from the, uh, this is from Kitchen Nightmares official channel. Why? What is this? Do you have, what, what happened? What is this thumbnail? What is this title? What is going on? Tonight, I'm nervous that Chef Ramsay may not think that the restaurant is running efficiently. I really hope that the staff hold it together and that they shine. Well, obviously, they're not going to. You're on Kitchen Nightmares for Pete's sake. Your restaurant's already gone down the rabbit hole of, of absolute crap. You're, you're, there's something wrong here. He's going to criticize something. You can't expect him to come in and not criticize something. Probably everything. I would say that the ticket times are not even five minutes for entree. Ah. For a second there, I was going to be like, all right, it doesn't seem like anything's wrong. They're going pretty fast. And then after they looped the microwave for like the fifth time, I was like, ah, I think I found the issue. I, I, huh. <laughs> yeah, I don't think restaurants are meant to be using microwaves this often, you know? You know, they should probably be cooking some actual shit. They should probably actually be cooking something, you know? Cook really fast. Hey, food! Okay, that's not cooking. I don't care. You can't say they cook really fast. You're not cooking it. You're reheating it. There's a difference. Ugh, I don't like these sound effects. Okay, wait, why is Gordon upset that they're coming out this fast? Like, of all the things that he says, I don't think he should be, like, saying that he's upset that it's coming out fast, because fast service isn't a bad thing. It's just the way that they're doing it is not correct. Gordon, I'm sorry, but you're wrong here. With food flying out of the kitchen. I think around, like, 10 minutes. 5 to 10 minutes is, like, a good wait time for food, you know? At an incredible pace. Three minutes. The kitchen staff okay, that, yeah, that is a little social. fast. That's a little fast. People are gonna start getting suspicious. Wait, what? Wait, what did, wait, what did they just say? You combed your hair and everything? I would hope so. He should also be wearing a hairnet. Like, what the heck? Why, why has he just got his hair out? He's gonna get hair in the fries. Have you cleared the board? All the tickets gone? Yeah. Wow. So just standing here for the next couple of minutes. I can't believe how fast the food comes out. It's like a conveyor belt. Is that bad? See, exactly. She's right. It's, it's not necessarily a bad thing. It's just the process of how they're doing it. It depends on quality. Okay. Exactly. See? Well, okay, now he's now he's he's avenged service. himself. Gordon Ramsay has avenged what he said before. The food. That's odd. If it was in a microwave, I wonder why it's dry. Maybe it's like overcooked and it just feels like hard, you know? But I feel like it would be more moist if it's cooked in a microwave because, I mean, I guess not because all the humidity like boils out of it. I don't know. I mean, it's not like I would come back to this. No, I know, obviously. Stop, stop, stop. <laughs> the the freaking waiter's like, yeah, I know, obviously. Like, come on, man. You can't you can't throw your restaurant under the gutter like that. Yeah, you, you gotta be like, oh, I'm so sorry to hear that. Um, I, is there anything we can do to make this a better experience for you? You got you gotta have good customer service, man. You can't just be like, nah. I, I, I'm I, trust me, I get it. Here is a drive through. I'm pissed. He's telling me that all my food is shit. It's very frustrating when I don't know how to do it another way because this is all that I know. So you only know how to make shit food. Got it. Thanks. Thanks for the thanks for the confirmation. That is unbelievable. This has to be the fastest serving restaurant in America tonight. But it's not really a <laughs> the way Gordon Ramsay speaks in these like um, cameo segments, it's like it's so weird. It's so unnatural. He's like, and this is how we do it. And <sighs> he takes like giant gasps of air between his words. I don't understand why they do it like this. It's it's just uncomfortable. It's a fast food factory. What a joke. On the heels of a ridiculously fast dinner service. Right, bye bye. <laughs> that guy is goaded. I love that guy. I mean, that guy is amazing. Thank you for thank you for including him. Chef Ramsay suspects that shortcuts are being taken in the kitchen. Wow, fast, man. So it's time for a little investigation. 
What do you mean investigation? What do you mean shortcut? He literally saw them taking <laughs> shit out and putting it in the microwave. How did... What do you mean he's investigating? He already knows what they're doing. It's not a secret. It's not a mystery. What are those? Tamales. Oh, the tamales. Yeah. They're the frozen. Ah. So these are your chimichangas. Are they frozen as well? Yeah. Frozen. Wow. When was all this made? Two months. He said two months? That's a long time. I don't, I don't, like, okay, for frozen food, if it's like your own food, sure, that's fine, right? But for restaurant food, come on, come on, at least make it like that week. Like, come on. Oh my God. Can you get me Laura, please? Yes, yes, I'm here, I'm here, I'm here. Why, why is she so, like, why is she rushing in like that, screaming, like, I'm here, I'm here, I'm here, I'm here, come on. Like, come on, you, you, the, your worry is making it worse. <laughs> You're not helping anything by showing that much fear. Come around, come around. Don't run. Not in the kitchen. Here's the thing. You're serving chicken that was cooked nearly two months ago. You're frosting it and then reheating it. And are you wondering why it's dry? Okay, yeah, that that would make the chicken dry, to be fair. Were you aware of this or? This is what we did for catering. Unbelievable. That may be why the place is struggling. Where are the freezers? The freezers there. I mean, so far, this restaurant doesn't seem that bad. The staff all seem fine. The manager seems okay. She just needs to, you know, cook her food when it's ordered. And then they, that, that's pretty much the problem solved so far. I take it all back. I hope everything's right in there. The shelving and all the food. Ugh. Ugh. That is nasty. Is that supposed to be a freezer or something? Like, why is it dripping? Why is it leaking? That, okay, now that's a health hazard. Look all this stuff here. Bloody hell. This is unbelievable. Look at that. This is what we did for catering. You must have hundreds of portions of stock here. He just kept grabbing and grabbing and stacking my arms with it. All this pre-cooked, pre-rolled, frozen. The thing is, she's smiling during this. You saw her smiling. Then she doesn't care. This just absolutely appalling this is not a restaurant i agree you this is this is like you're buying your frozen food from walmart and you're just reheating it but you're paying extra like this isn't a restaurant this this is not how it should be done I gotta wash my hands fucking stink i have a man back there tripping everything apart telling me i don't know what the fuck i'm doing why do you have to specify it's a man huh 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 you trying to get pity points huh when somebody takes something that you have Thank you.